Meals are the center of family time, and they really bring people together. Always. My favorite kind of meal? Italian. You know that, but I may I be a little biased. If you want real authentic food, the Italian food, you mean, that you, that'll you make your mouth water. One word for you. We got Moresco's. We are so excited. Today, we're entering Ethel's Italian Kitchen with Chef Ethel Merriman of Moresco's Italian Market. Yeah, well, good to see you. Good morning. So happy to have you. I mean, I literally was going through reviews yesterday on Facebook of Moresco's, and every single one of them were just making my mouth water. So we're excited to have you. Thank you so much for having me on this morning. Absolutely. I'm so excited to tell you about Moresco's Italian Market. And yes. I'm excited to, to learn about it because uh -huh. I was there this week. I visited. I had the Italian beef sandwich. was fantastic, by the way. What are we making today? Mm -hmm. Today we're making a cacao de pepe. De Pepe, which is basically um, cheese and black pepper pasta. In the Italian tradition, meals take good quality, simple ingredients and turn them into an extraordinary meal. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, at Moresco's, we carry most things that are imported from Italy, mm -hmm. lots of imported pastas and olive oils. And this morning I started, I had to start. Yeah. First, yeah, yeah, exactly. you gotta go on. with a, a cold pan, a little encouragement using the Cento Sicilian okay. olive oil, mm -hmm. a little pancetta, and what, Mike, you're going to help me make the sauce, yeah, you got to get okay. in there. Yeah. Dig in, Mike. Okay, so what I want you to do. What do you have in there? You said black pepper. Uh, what do you have in there What already? I did was I just used a little bit of olive oil for encouragement, mm -hmm. but um, I cooked the pancetta, just rendered out yeah. the fat, and that's what you have in the pan. Can you explain what pancetta is out there for pancetta people? Pancetta is um, an yeah. unsmoked bacon. It is okay. the Italian version of bacon. Now you need to whisk. The beauty of this sauce is that you take the fat. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Mike. You gotta watch out for the uh, splattering olive oil. I couldn't. <laughs> I can't control that. And you add a little of the starchy water from your pasta. Okay. And just adding it a little at a time as you whisk that, it's gonna emulsify it. Yeah. So, giving it a little more of a whisk, it should turn it into a little bit mm -hmm. creamier mm. consistency. Yes. How many labels do you put in there? Of well, the, you're just of the water? doing it to, to make a sauce. Okay. It smells fantastic. It does smell good. And today I'm using a pumpkin shaped pasta because mm -hmm. it is yeah. the season. Kayla said that she was like, you got to check out the pasta. It's pumpkin shaped. It <laughs> yeah. Is, yeah. I've got a lot of shapes and colors of pasta. So, what kind of pasta is that? Is that it's an organic pasta from Italy. Yeah. What do you, what do you call this? What's does this pasta have a name? It does. It's zucchette. 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 And you can buy and this. All of this. We stuff add the Marascos. pancetta back in, and as you continue to um, stir this up, we'll is turn that Parmigiano that. Romano? What do it you is use? a, a pecorino Romano. Okay. Which is a little sharper taste than the. Um, Parmesan, the Grana Padana. A lot of the Italians cook with Romano. Um, Parmesan's good, but it does have a little sharper taste than the, yeah. uh, the Romano does than the Parmesan. That looks and fabulous. Just, we are located across the street from Rockbrook mm -hmm. uh -huh. at 108th and Center. And hey, you've only been open, I mean. 10 months. Ten We're so excited. Well, and yeah. people, people know about Moresco as the word has gotten around. Okay, so here we have a finished di dish in Less than 10 minutes. Yeah, that right. was easy. And it is, I mean, that was like, yeah, that was a, just a Should few minutes. Should we spoon minutes. it out onto this big plate? This is how the Italians serve it in a yes. big bowl like exactly. this. Exactly. Right, and then now, you pass it around the table. Exactly. While you're doing that, I want to clarify, Moresco's is not necessarily a restaurant. You We're come, not. It's like a grocery. You come and you pick up these fine Italian ingredients and you put together these meals yourself. We have at all home. of these ingredients right. in the store. Now, where are you getting these ingredients from? I source my ingredients from all over. Uh -huh. I try very hard to have imported, everything imported. Mm -hmm. I do my best, although we have a large Italian community here in Omaha. I am learning that. And they're, they're everywhere. They're everywhere. And <laughs> I was requested to have the Chicago style Italian hot beef sandwiches. Yes. And 
The, the, my customers tell me it lives up to it. Well, this customer told you it lives up to it. The Italian mm -hmm. beef sandwich is fantastic. You dip it in the, so the, the au jus type sauce, it's fantastic. Oh, and this yeah. is just an example of some of the stuff you have at the yes. deli because you do sell, there is a grocery uh, store kind of attached to this. Big, and, big grocery, this we're a full Sicilian, deli. And yes. this is a Sicilian olive oil and you have different varieties of olive oil. Yes. How many? Do you know how many different varieties? Oh no, I have olive oils that have truffle in them, that have lemon, mm -hmm. that have basil. Right, that have so a little bit of everything. everything. You now, need a little wine. Now, okay, so I'm yeah. a wino, could you, everybody could you knows open that. that? I mean, Abs okay, I will open this. Watch how fast she is at opening wine. I mean, she's a professional. Crack, open. <laughs> Two seconds. <laughs> now what, so you, do you have a full wine selection there? We do. We, uh, we only carry Italian wines and liquors. And uh, while she's pouring the wine, I didn't need a, well, that was I'm going to grab glass. the bread, and I'm going to bring this over here. Sure. The bread and the um, Let me the move dipping all this sauce. Out of the this way. is a is, this is an olive oil base. What what is this uh, that you is, dip the bread in right here? We, what we have is um, an herb olive oil mm -hmm. that's just a little something. When I have people over to my home, mm -hmm. I like to, everyone gathers at the kitchen. Yeah. That's yes. what happens. Yes. Uh, yeah, yeah. And, everybody, That's what it's and, then, you, and then you're kicking about. people out of the kitchen, get out of my way so I can make I the pasta. I put hors out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Say, come on in. So I love bread mm, so much. That's fantastic. First, I'm going to do this because it's sitting here and it smells great. Mm -hmm. I got to get the perfect bite. I'm all about the perfect bite. Also, you have recipes for people that are looking to, well, you got the grocery store and if people want to come in and, and purchase some of the authentic. Italian goods, you have mm. recipes for them as well. We have recipes, and I have the recipe for this. How is it, Kelly? Very good. Did you see my face? I'm going right back. Going right back in there. I'm try that too. Uh, but the recipes, oh, you have recipes is, for people, right? We have recipes. We have um, all of the products that you could possibly need to, to make a fine Italian mm. meal with very little money. That Push is fantastic. That is, that is fantastic. It, it seems like it's kind of a naked pasta, but it's got amazing flavor. Oh, this is fantastic! Great, I love that. Good wine. Red wine, Italian wine. Uh, people can find Morasco's in Rockbrook, right yes. on kind of across the street from the main part yes. of Rockbrook, right? Yeah, right across the street on 108th. Yes. Um, we carry wines, liquors, pastas, sauces. Um, it's authentic. It's, it's authentic, authentic. It's all Italian. Good, yeah. It's all it's good. And for I'm your holidays, it. we do holiday gift baskets. We oh. will deliver free anywhere in the o Omaha metro area. Free delivery. Wow. Yes. And our baskets are filled with authentic Italian goodies from the the chocolate little kisses to the to the liqueurs mm -hmm. to the biscotti to the the uh, colorful pasta. I brought a few pastas this morning, mm -hmm. but we carry a whole line that's of colorful. That's just a sampling that's, of what you got. It's such a small Listen, sampling. Listen, you can find Moresco's. Stop in if you're going to have a holiday gathering. This recipe right here, are you going to give us the recipe and so we can put it on our website? I yes. So. Okay. And um, you know what they say? Kiss French, eat Italian. Kiss French. Ah, <laughs> they I do love say that. that. They do say that's that. That's I love And then they also say manja. So that's what manja. we're going to do. Thanks for coming. You're, Thank this is your last so visit. Much. We're going to get more recipes out yes, of you in the coming she'll months. She'll be back. Okay, thanks uh -huh. a lot for coming.